hey guys welcome back to another video if you're new here you can feel free to subscribe so in this video we will be doing a half sewing off braided style so as you can see i already braided her here off camera i'm oiling her scalp because she have a lot of um dry scalp so i'm oiling that so you know it won't itch a bit and then she'll have to take it out faster than how she put it in so once there is dry scalp in the hair you have to oil the ear you can use anything to oil it you can use ear oil you can use um growth oil you can use sulfur it it doesn't really matter but you just need something to oil the scalp so as you can see i'm doing the i'm i start begin to sew in the tracks in her hair and yes she has some show me the scalp on her phone where she wants and i'm sewing in the track so i'm gonna sew the tracks at the back she have actually three bundles i'm going to try my best to use all three bundles because she said that she wanted to be fluffy and nice so i sew the tracks under the bottom so you know once she put it up you know it won't it will actually you'll actually see tracks you won't see the corner or anything so i'm doing the sewing right here and i have to do the sewing off camera because uh, my phone was dying and i had to let it get some charge and then i get back to the videoing so after i do the sewing off camera um she did some screenshots of how she want the front to be braided and then you know my angle mixing don't mind the ink on my finger it was election day today and i went and vote i opened a good go vote and i'm just gonna braid the front of her hair and then you know um i use the edge control you know to keep the ear in place you know we don't have any loose hair all over the place and then you're going to start adding the braid in her hair so you're gonna start from a small portion until you go up to a bigger portion where you know it will be the size that you desire i ask her to hold the braid for me because i don't really like using the braid wrap so for persons who love ask questions as to why the customer have to hold the braid yes i always ask my customers to hold the braid in here because i don't know why i don't like using the braiding rack so you know once you um i do the first car no, i have to ask her to hold it so it don't twist up and all sort of something because you know it's the first one and then you're going to braid it right down to the length of the hair and then we're going to curl the end of that so you know it will have a little you know a little buzz or something something yeah so you guys can just stay tuned watch me slay this style and remember to like share and if you haven't yet subscribed you can feel free to subscribe just go ahead and get me to a thousand subscribers i will be very grateful for that also you can tell a friend to come and subscribe to my channel and as i said in my previous video i will be trying my best to do some different genre of videos like you know probably like a vlog a day in my life and stuff like that so you know everything takes time and i'm a very busy person so once i get the time i will definitely do it i have a challenge to do with my older son i have this challenge to do like and i don't even know i don't even know how long but a long time long time in one way to the challenge so i'm gonna get that done and then i'm gonna upload it on my page but before i upload it on my page i would have to get my page at least 600 subscribers so if you don't want to see the challenge i'm gonna have to subscribe and tell people to come subscribe to my page like yeah and as you see i put some small braids in her hair she was complaining as to how she's going to pull those out and all those stuff but she will manage i know she will so 
thank you guys so much if you reached this far in the video thank you guys so very much for watching and i hope you continue watching right until the end and then you can leave a comment as to how i did bye